you're seeking re-election, why? Well, I want to finish the program that I started, particularly those that deal with the revitalization of the inner city. Well, I think that I've demonstrated in my term in the council that the things that I've worked on relate to people, the 10 cent bus fare, the utility rate, uh, outside consultant, the, the consumer affairs ordinances that we've brought forward, the, the, the tough zoning decisions that I've made, the no votes on in the areas of the Turtle Creek uh, uh, high rise. I think those are things that relate to people, and I think that we're going to see those things in, in the coming two years more and more. Well, uh, I have been an effective uh, representative of the people. I've approached the problems of the city in a very knowledgeable way, and then, too, I have very unique qualifications for serving on this council. Such as? Well, I was born and raised in the Vatio, and I understand the people problems that we have to deal with if we're going to revitalize the city. My voting record has been a, uh, uh, an independent voting record. Uh, I am an independent candidate, and uh, all of the people of Dallas vote for me. And the reason that uh, I run at large is I feel that the projects and programs that I'm working on are at large projects and programs, and I, I want the, uh, the support of the people. Nobody has to tell me about the problems. I, I understand them because I've lived them. I think, too, that uh, my training as an architect uh, enables me to understand the problems that we're going to face in the, in the redevelopment of the city. Uh, he's a CCA uh, candidate, and his, has been, uh, his voting record is a CCA voting record. As a businessman, I, I pay taxes, and, I, and I'm sensitive to the burden that the taxpayer carries uh, whenever we uh, develop new programs to deal with the problems in the community. I voted against the Dallas Power and Light rate request, and as you know that I've pushed uh, for my entire term on the council uh, for an outside consultant to, to look into the area of utilities. I'm chairman of the Utility Rates Committee, and I feel that we need more expertise in the area of utility rates, and, and so I voted no there. Well, obviously, you know, uh, the, uh, the ordinance obviously was not read by, by anybody, and, and it was an unfortunate thing that uh, it happened the way it did, but it surprised everybody. I don't know of a single soul that, that knew any different at the time they voted on it.